what's going on guys? We're back with Tech Vitamins and, uh, and right here we got a new rig we're building. Uh, this is going to be specifically for Pro Tools, uh, music production, video production for Tech Vitamins and other stuff. And um, we're going to be showing you how we're going to install all these different products that we purchased for this. We're going to tell you about budgeting, what's, you know, what you can take away from and what you can add to in terms of money. Uh, we can add to the future, and I guess we'll go ahead and get started. Um, so, what do we got first? I guess first you gotta go with the motherboard. There's a reason it's called the motherboard, um, and I actually made a mistake by building this rig. I ordered a different case initially, and then we have to go with this one, which is a Zigma Tech uh, Elysium case. And the reason is, hold this up. The motherboard that we're putting in is. EVGA SR2 motherboard, uh, one of the larger ones on the, on the market. It's an HPTX uh, form factor, so there's only a few cases out there that can actually handle it, but uh, we'll be using that motherboard. And other than uh, the motherboard, the next probably most important thing you want to think about when you're building a rig is the power supply. So we're going to be using a 1,000 uh, watt power supply right there. Um, we'll also show you once we unbox that how to kind of calculate what you're going to be using and if it's enough or not. Um, and luckily this case has space for two power supplies in case we did our math wrong. Um, next thing we're going to be putting in is two Xeon processors. Uh, they are the 6 core uh, Westmere um, 56 100 series processor and we got two of them because this motherboard is a dual chipset motherboard, a server motherboard. Uh, we got a video card, if you want to hold it up. It's a 2 gigabyte, um, 256 bit EVGA GTX 560Ti, specifically made for overclocking, we'll get into that later when we're installing the uh, video card. Let's see, um, I already mentioned the chips, we've got uh, some water blocks, because we are going to be using water cooling for this rig, uh, let me hold it up real quick. Which also brings us to, there we go, and this is actually not usually what you would do when you're thinking about water cooling with a case like this, but because I got a different case to begin with, I'm just going to go ahead and stick with a uh, dual bay uh, thermal take um, cooling block which was initially made for the, I think the Level GT Snow Edition case, but uh, it'll do for this case just fine for what we're trying to do. And um, let's see, we got two 23-inch LED monitors that are going to be uh, running this. And of course your odds and ends, and you know, you got your hard drive, which we need, and uh, our optical drive, uh, of course, Lovely, lovely memory. Uh, gonna be running 24 gigs of memory. Yep, we'll get into that when we install the memory. We got a little cool uh, fan controller which goes in the front of the case. Not necessary most of the time, but it was on sale, mm -hmm. so I got one. And we also have a Firewire uh, PCI card. For some reason, nowadays, the majority of the motherboards or cases don't have the Firewire. Outputs in it. and this is mainly for Pro Tools. The interface that I'm using has to run through Firewire, um, so that's the reason we got this. It's pretty cheap. And we got some adapters, uh, HDMI to DVI adapters for the monitors in the back of the video card. But um, if you stick with us, we're going to have multiple videos. We're going to get into each one of these parts. We're going to do a review, installation, unboxing, all that good stuff. So yeah. Yeah. hopefully you're going to enjoy this. I got to. Give a shout out to our sponsors, our unofficial sponsors right here for this video. It's the Flying Dog Raging Bitch Beer. It's going to power us through this journey. And last but not least, I'm going to make a public announcement for all the young computer builders, you know, geeks, tech gurus out there. When you're building your first rig, please do me a favor and use protection. Please ground yourself. Well, we got both of these right here. We're going to be grinding ourselves to the case. The last thing you want to do is rub your feet on the carpet and uh, short, short out a $600 motherboard. So let's get started. 